Hello and happy Sunday to you all. Are y'all ready to cook with me, the hood girl? Guess what we're cooking today? We are going to be uh, cooking some spicy honey garlic chicken thighs. Y'all ready to cook? Come on, come on, come on. I'm going to show you what we're doing. Let's do it. But first of all, let's... Um, we're going to bake these chicken thighs uncovered uh, in 350 um, oven. So I'm preheating that right now. But come on over to the seasonings. We're about to season this chicken. And then we're going to do the sauce. And then we're going to get it in the oven. Come on. All right, y'all. See, we have chicken thighs. They have been washed, clean, dried, padded. Slap and all that other goodness that we do with the chicken. All right, y'all. Y'all know my season is always the same. A table. I have a half a. Uh, I mean, I have a teaspoon of salt, a half a tablespoon of uh, Laurie seasoned salt. I have a tablespoon of of my Spanish smoke uh, paprika, a tablespoon of onion and garlic powder, and I found something new. I did a half a tablespoon of complete. But by Badia, it has a great flavor. It has uh, onions and garlic and thyme and parsley already in there. So I just did a half a tablespoon of this. And of course, y'all know I did a tablespoon of pepper. So let's get that stirred about. We're going to get the sick, the, ch the, sicken, the chicken seasoned, y'all. And then we're going to put it in the oven uncovered. You know, these are bone in. So... I think it takes about 40 to 50 minutes. So what we're going to do is put it in the oven uncovered. And then that sauce that we're going to make in a moment. Uh, well, in a minute, we're going to make this sauce. And while the chicken is cooking, we're going to let that sauce marinate in the refrigerator for about 20 to 30 minutes. And then uh, we'll pour it uh, on that chicken at the second half of cooking. So... Uh, yeah, this is going to be good. I'm just going to prepare some uh, buttered rice um, on the side and maybe, or even some uh, mashed potatoes and some kind of vegetable, y'all. So that's the seasonings uh, that we have. So let's get this chicken season. Y'all know I like to do my seasonings underneath the skin because when you bite in this chicken, you want flavor. You do not want hospital tasting food so y'all always know that i have a dry hand and a wet hand when i season my food so let's get it done Try not to tell your skin, y'all. Who that season? This um mixture of seasoning smells so doggone good. That's gonna be really good, y'all. And y'all, if y'all make too much seasoning, you know, if you have a, a airtight container, honey, you just uh, put it in one of your empty dishes, uh, bowls but with a tight lid and you can have it. You can have it for a minute. Mmm, -hmm, it smells good. Let's, let's flip these over, y'all. I'm excited about this. I found this recipe... Uh, of course, on Google. <laughs> oh, that's going to be good. Mm. 
Get it all in them crevices, y'all. I sure wish y'all can smell this. Let's flip that back over. And make sure y'all skin is over because we want that to get a really beautiful color uh, when it's cooking. Uncovered. Did I say that? And don't forget when you're washing your chicken, all all that all that um, skin that's left over, cut that cut that off. You don't want that uh, on on your food. You don't want that. Mm, 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 mm. That uh, smoked paprika have a strong flavor, and it does make your food smell taste. Smoke it. Let's watch our hands. All right. We're going to sit this chicken to the side, to that uh, oven preheats, but let me wipe off this stove. That's a no-no. So, y'all, now we're about to do the ingredients for the sauce that we're gonna put again, as I said, on the, the second half of cooking, 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 cooking. All right, y'all. So in this bowl, we're gonna add honey, hot sauce, uh, we're going to add in four fine chopped, well this is actually five, <laughs> fine chopped fresh garlic and then I chopped, fine chopped some onion. We're going to put all these flavors in here and we're going to use a soy sauce. Forgive me y'all, I should have had it out. All right, y'all, I'm just shaking my bottle of uh, Kikkoman soy sauce. We need three tablespoons of soy sauce. So let's get that in once we get that shaking and really, 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 really good. So we need three tablespoons of this, and we're going to need a fourth a cup of chicken broth too, y'all. All right, three tablespoons soy sauce. One, two, can y'all see this? That's three tablespoons of soy sauce. We're gonna do two tablespoons of honey. Do y'all keep honey in your, in, your, in your cupboard? I do. Let's get another spoon and get that honey out of there. We don't want to miss no honey, honey. <laughs> hey, we don't want to miss no honey, honey. Uh-uh, we ain't gonna look at all that honey stuck in there. Don't, don't let that honey stay stuck in there. Get that honey out of there. We need two of them. I think I'm going to need another thing of honey, y'all. Oh, yes, yeah, got to go on the list. But I do have two tablespoons, that's for sure. And I made a couple of left. There you go. You, you know, you can use sriracha hot sauce. If you like, 
I don't like sriracha like that. So I got my Louisiana on, on board over here waiting for me. So uh, I'm, I'm going to do one tablespoon of Louisiana hot sauce, y'all. However hot you like it, your spicy uh, chicken, you got to do what you do. You want a fourth a cup of chicken broth. Oh, y'all, that smells good. Y'all, I'm telling you, this smell is doggone delicious smelling. Y'all, we're going to add in, uh, just so y'all know, I'm, I'm about my salt. But I'm not going to add in a lot of salt. Maybe a half a tablespoon of pepper. I'm talking about salt. A pepper, that is. Oh, that's going to be good. And I'm just going to sprinkle a little salt, y'all. Maybe a half a teaspoon because you already got that salt on that chicken. Oh, it's the, the oven have went out. I'm going to put the timer. I'm going to put this chicken in uncovered, y'all. Nothing else on it. And I'm going to let, I'm going to set a timer for, because it cooks 45 to 50 minutes. I'm going to set a timer for 25 minutes. And that's how long we're going to let this sauce marinate. Uh, as well, y'all. Okay, so let's get the garlic in here. And let's get that onion. You can use one small onion. Make sure it's finely chopped. Or you can use as many onions or garlic as you like, y'all. Y'all do your flavor like you want to do your flavor. But it's going to be good. We're going to give that a stir. Mm, 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 mm. Ooh, get it all incorporated in there, y'all. I'll love it. Look at that. It smells so good. Y'all know I got to taste this now. I'm gonna let it. I'm gonna let it marinate though. But I just got to taste and see if I want to add anything to this. You know, a woman in. The, well, I'll just say this. I can't talk about other cooks. I'm gonna talk about black folk, honey. We like our stuff seasoned, and you know, sometimes we got to add in some other stuff if it's not the flavor that we think it's supposed to be or what we like on our palate. So, uh, y'all, I'm going to taste this because if I need to add some garlic powder, y'all know I'm all about that garlic powder. And uh, I'm going to do what I need to do for me as uh, this is uh, spicy honey garlic thighs. So let's get some on the spoon and let's give it a taste. Oh, shoot. Mm-mm. Man, that's going to be delicious. You don't need to add nothing. So, y'all, let me get that covered up and put in the refrigerator. Dang, that's good. Goodness. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's delicious. Y'all, this is delicious. So, imagine that's going on top of your... Oh, that's the big one. On top of your chicken, honey, after it has crisp that skin and then... Crisp it up, but I think I'm going to, once uh, I do it on the second half of the chicken, I'm going to uh, put it under a brawler as well if I need to. Y'all, if y'all can taste this sauce right here, oh my God, honey, mm, that is delicious. So I'll see y'all on the second half, and we're going to just do this. Y'all got to make it. All right, y'all, that chicken half cooked for 25 minutes. It did not have the color that I wanted, so I put it under the brawler at 500 on the top shelf for four minutes. 
every three minutes just look at it because you do not want that to burn so uh y'all that's it right there now we're going to take that sauce that we made it was sitting uh for now 30 minutes since i had to do the brawler um i'm just gonna baste this over the chicken and then we're gonna cook it for another 25 minutes covered i think i want it covered so y'all but first of all i want to pour some of this juice off of here y'all so let me get best cook in the hood on I just want to pour a bit of it off. I have already cooked the buttered rice as well. And I'm going to do some baked beans on the side. So give me one minute, y'all. Let me get some of this off of here. All right, I pulled a lot of that oil off of that. We don't want, because when we spoon this over our rice, you know, we don't want all that grease. Y'all know that, right? So if you will, oh, that's gonna be good. Oh, honey. We'll come back a second time, y'all. No worries, it's plenty. That chicken smells so good. We're gonna put all this on this chicken, y'all. I just want the first coating to be over it, and then the rest is just uh, additional honey. So no worries, let's get that on. Ooh, honey. My, my, my. Mmm. Y'all, that's going to be so good. I wish I could invite y'all to dinner. I'm just doing the juice, making sure I, I'm getting all this good juice on here, y'all. Then we'll come and just drizzle the uh, garlic and onion. Oh, y'all just want that saturated. And then I'm gonna step out at the pool for a moment. I hear, I hear them. I was supposed to be out there already, y'all. But you know, I like cooking after after church. You know, I'm that southern girl. Mm mm mm. Yeah, the smell is fantastic. Can y'all see this spoon over y'all rice? I know I can. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. All right, y'all, we're gonna get this covered. We're gonna be putting this in the oven for the next 30 minutes and I'll see you after it's done. Uh, I hope y'all enjoying it. That is the finishing product, y'all. Look how good that look. Let's take a bite. Okay, y'all, we got some rice on that plate, that good old buttered rice. Uh, let's get a piece of this beautiful chicken. Look at that. And we're gonna get some of those juices over there. Mm -mm -mm. Now let's give it a taste. Oh, that juice is good. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Let's taste a bite of this chicken, y'all. Y'all want a bite? There you go. It's hot, y'all. Oh, hot. Mm, 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 mm. It's good.